Okay, so Daywalker in the Green Boys. I, I knew him when he was still a noob. <laughs> <laughs> I've seen him play when he was 20, always getting getting uh, getting um, He's been advice from his big daddy Randy. He's been playing this to for his years. Left. <laughs> 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 to his left, a shaman. Shamona. Uh, an shaman. Another one of Randy's protégés. He likes to bring them up and... Uh, <laughs> Hi again. I didn't know when he joined the pro, but uh, Daywalker and Shaman were all, all, always pro, right? I think. Yeah. Hi again is a recruit, like they found in the game. A few months ago. Yep. Yep. Elmer Fudd also a recruit from in the game, I believe. Yep. Or was think, he always pro? I, I think he think was so. recruited a bit earlier than uh, High Gain. Yeah, if yeah, I'm not yeah. mistaken. I, I think you're right. And then of course Big Daddy Randy on the top left in blue, uh, the captain. 100% for sure the captain. <laughs> he's uh, he's the pro. He's the pro. Yeah, he's the head pro. We'll start yep. on the bottom left. We got slow, which means evil, as I've, as I've learned. Wait, OP. Oh, wow. And we got the Cruz, part of the game development team. He still hasn't learned that Whistlers and Janus are OP. Maybe he'll learn during this uh, tournament. Hey. And we got hey, the... Oh, hello in the club. Hi. We... How is the, the result so far? For this uh, it's 1-0 one one oh. for Pro. 1-0 one one for, for Pro. And then we have pro. these server issues. Pro. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> we have a 1-1 one -one against a Factor team against Bullshock. Uh, we have a Tom Ruler com drop. Insanely clutch. You need to actually watch that replay in LDM's stream because it was the play of the tournament so far. Insane. Oh, wow. Okay. Yeah, yeah. X Factor got boosted. He he was like rushing the 4 minute T2 lap. And Tom Ruler just dropping there with like almost his transport died into fighter, so it was really clutch, really nice play. So yeah, that was it's one one. It's really interesting because most people predict like three zero for Gucci team and X Factor. So it's one one. So yeah, it's going to be a long series. Oh nice, good to hear. Yeah. Good to hear. That yeah. sounds very interesting indeed. Yeah, hopefully the servers uh, came back up so mm -hmm. we can. Hopefully the, the servers survive the tournament. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Okay, going back with the Liam, guys. Keep it up. All right. Yeah. Keep Bye. it up, boys. So, okay. Back to us. We got Genjuro, who's uh, CJ. P. Tuck. Also part of the game development team. Very OP. And uh, we got 8D, also known as 8 Dimensions. I, I'd say 8D and, uh, you know, 8D and CJ, both in my clan, AFF. Even though he's not uh, displaying the AFF. There's he a... Is? He is, CJ is. <laughs> he, there's also another player called Genjiro, but he's part of the Beyond All Baguette clan. And he's like uh -huh, uh -huh. 15 or lower than CJ. It's a, it's a bit confusing because we've seen him play against each other. <laughs> we have two Genjiros on opposing teams. <laughs> oh, okay, okay, okay. okay. Yeah, we got the. Oh, they did. All three of them co opted one lab. I told you, they have, some, they have some juicy strats. Damn. And they're, they're and all now they're going to be producing units like there's no tomorrow, trust yeah, me. Yeah, and the triple counter it here, yep. Oh, they're going to be zooming shit out of that factory, trust me. Daywalker went to naval on the top right there. It's not a bad yeah. idea. You can shut down a lot of stuff with the destroyers and frigates. Pitak flying to the front to try and secure the mid mechs. The most OP mechs. It, it's, it's quite crucial, uh, I think, this area. This triple mechs. Uh-oh, uh-oh. He's looking for D-Guns. He's not gonna get them. Oh, he's gonna oh. get one. Uh, he got the Janus. <laughs> he got the Janus. Most important unit, yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah and he's out of there. <laughs> Zekrus yeah, 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 yeah. building a bot lab on the ledge. He, did he also is go doing the thing. Yeah, he did he... the thing. But he did start naval. He's... Oh, yeah, he it? reclaimed though. He Maybe... reclaimed it. Yeah, he reclaimed, yeah. And it's, Wait, it's Slow still... is doing... He's cooking. Sea Yellow, planes. he's cooking. Oh, yeah. That is... Uh... That is a chef right there. Seaplanes are very, very powerful. Even if they swap over to T1 Air, the enemy team, I mean, they're not going to be able to counter the T1, uh, the, the we have Seaplane a few... fighters. Yeah, we don't even have air going on from mm -hmm. Team Pro right now. Uh, There's basically no air. There's a C, a, a joint Daywalker. lab, and that's it. Daywalker is reclaiming his uh, naval lab. Probably might swap. I, I wonder if it's going to be. It is Seaplanes. It is Seaplanes. It's not amphibious. Mm. So yeah, this is a hard counter, but Daywalker is going to have a lot more resources than uh, than Zlow, because he is going to control all these mechs by himself, and uh, whereas yeah, Zlow has yeah, to yeah. share with uh, Zekrus. But uh, Zekrus is pressuring with thugs. 
over on the left Admiral side. Admiral should be able to hold this, I yeah. think. It's a very, very awkward angle against the commander yeah, and the LLPs. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You just hide behind the thing and then Deegan when they go out. He has beamers on the other side, which is yeah. good that he does because thugs will kill anything else that's not a beamer. It's beamers, right? I don't no, think those I are just LLTs. Uh, Randy's got uh, what? what Randy's oh, got though, on not, the other hand. Oh. Randy's got claws. Three of them. Oh, yeah, it's not, nothing is going through that, that's for sure. It's yeah, time to take up the cruise. <laughs> And high no. gain, I'm surprised he doesn't have more units with the triple lab. Oh, they gave off the lab. Uh, is that a T2 they're building? I think yeah. so. Look at, look at CJ's aggressive lab placement. They are Super going for early T2. T2. Both Super lab early T2. on that. I look guess they maybe, maybe they want to do spiders and go over this hill and kill Zekrus and stuff. I don't know. I've seen that being done a lot in practice games. I think that oh. might be. Yeah. Okay. Are they going to gang up on AD on the right side? With double... Uh... Commander? Uh, AT? Uh, AT is the air player, I see. So they're gonna have yep. double air. But they... Oh, look at look at the scout. They're gonna spot the the seaplanes. Yep, he spotted oh, the seaplanes. Yeah, yep. they, they know, they know. They see now they know. They got two air players, one of them seaplanes. So either either Mr. Uh, Daywalker spams they're fighters... They're showing seaplanes too, though. They're already yeah, showing they are. Planes. They're using gunships to try and snipe AT's commander instead of just dying to all his anti-air. Mm -hmm. It's very yep. rough. They they are killing. Oh look at this! They're going for Mexus yep. instead with the seaplane. That's not a bad I, idea oh. actually. If you go for eco. It's gonna get shot down, but yeah. it's still decent. Yeah, there's some damage. Mixes. Force out a lot of anti-air boss as well. Yeah, forcing anti-air, getting a two mixes. It's all right. Elmer El Fudd still diffing. He's yeah. doing clutch defense over here. But at least Zekrus is uh, occupying two players. Right. But I don't think they're ready for the T2. That, that's yeah, the thing. Yeah, that's gonna come. Uh, probably, they, well, they, they took the Geo now. I think they might rush a T2. A, a Geo, I mean. Wouldn't mm, be a bad it idea. Might be a, it might be a, a pushy, pushy T2, though. Uh, pushy Geo, uh, though. The Prude. Uh, oh, no. Uh, the Prude. Because the position is like... It's kind of iffy to do a non-Prude yeah, now. Not only is it close to the, to the T2 lab, it's also close to the edge. Which makes it easy to yeah, kill. Yeah, yeah, exactly. It's like, it's such... Uh, it's such a risky, risky... Oh, look at that. He queued hero. up 100 recluses. He made one gunslinger and 100 recluses. This man knows. <laughs> so, this man good. knows. Is that the they're scouting going T2? gets denied by some fighters in the this, back. This T2 lab is gonna die to the oh, recluses. Oh, wow. That's an interesting placement of a T2 lab, though. Yeah. They feel safe up there. Mm. That's the thing. They That's why they go They T2. shouldn't feel safe. <laughs> But the thing is, it's also like, it's an aggressive position, which is good, but it's also bad in the sense that it's so far forward that yeah. the T2, they're going to have to transport them, I guess. Daywalker like and Shamon managed, managed to expel AD completely from that side. At least, you know, AD denied this with minimum cost to himself. He just built towers. He wasn't really making yeah. units. No, I agree. I agree. But they, they also have lost mid control. CJ is trying, but CJ only has medium tanks here against... A wall of Janus and Whistlers and medium tanks. It's a small wall though, it's yeah. not the worst. Yeah. He's not I don't think he's gonna be able to push a lot. If if he micro this perfectly, if he got high against commander, I think the biggest problem is actually the commander in this narrow lane. He can degun a lot of <sighs> Yeah. And he doesn't have a single oh, no, Janus. Definitely the issue. If he had a few Janus, he could easily kill Higgins, but I right, see like uh, high gain, uh, he needs to a lot of AoE him. from uh, the Janus. He needs a micro, but the they, they must know something's up because that's yeah. a very few units for yep. a front, right? And here comes the spiders. Uh oh. Oh, they're so clumped up, they're gonna take a lot of damage from the chat spiders. <laughs> oh, yeah, yeah, the spiders are starting to show its worth here. Oh, Hello. My. look at oh, that. My look at that. Oh, CJ, yeah. dodge. <laughs> <laughs> Sp spiders are surprisingly good, right? I think I learned yep. that during the console meta. I used to I, think spiders were a that, joke. I learned that thanks to uh, my boy Skag. <laughs> <laughs> uh, but you need weapons to make them extra OP, right? Weapons off a line of sight in particular. Wait, which, how much damage did he take? Oh, <laughs> gee, Jesus. Oh, he's dead, he's dead. Uh, yeah, not good oh, enough bullet uh, health. The Whistler oh. as well. Oof. And that, oh, that, there goes God. half his army in the process. Oh, oh the they, sniping cops. Air? They're going for comps. There's two comps left. AT's exposed. Oh, but look, the, the, the T2 lab. Oh, he doesn't. 
They don't see it? Do they see it? Oh, they, now they must see it. They're going sure. for commanders, I think. Oh, uh, yep. Yeah. Okay. They got, uh, they got Zekrus's comp. Oh. They got hey, CT's comp. Die. They're going, they're going no. for AT. No, he's no. cloaked. He, he cloaked, he cloaked, he cloaked. <laughs> but uh, units are coming up from Elber. He's got Jan as medium tank. But now and they Rick know, uses. they know the T2 and it's exposed. Yeah. This... It's gonna die. Even if the units don't kill it, Elmer Fod's gonna degun that shit. He's going yeah, for it. Yeah, it's gone. It's he gone. smells the degun. Oh, and yeah, AT yeah, decloaking and walking forward against Janus and the uh, and the gunslinger is very rough. And they're gonna get I mean, to reclaim though. I don't think though. he has E. I don't think he has the E to full cloak. Yeah. Yeah. They're, they're getting already oh, they resigned. Did, did, yeah. yeah, they lost it. Instantly resigned. Wow, that was fast. That was I mean, really fast. The pro clan bro. really good cooperation here, right? Yeah, they're like, okay, we're gonna greet T2, build units that's hard to push into, use commanders to delay, and then it's just, they were so early with the T2, it's like, yeah. boom, you can't push on that map, it's too narrow. I think that's the strat, like, it's so narrow, you can't really push with, um, like, how do you push with your uh, units if there's just a calm sitting there, like, it's yeah, super Yeah, exactly, hard. can't. Oh, fantastic, I got logged out again. I actually got logged out too. <laughs> oh, GG. <laughs> <laughs> and I accidentally knocked over my energy drink. Okay. You have energy drinks? Yes. But I feel like you have so much energy already. Oh, that's only because I have the energy drink. <laughs> oh, okay, I see, I see. When, when, when do you get uh, sponsored by the... By Red Bull? Drink? Oh my god. <laughs> oh, it's oh, Red Bull too. <laughs> 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 hey, Red Bull, hit me up, baby. <laughs> hit me up, baby. <laughs> I wish. Holy I mean, shit. have you seen my smile? Look at that smile. I, know. Look. I have. I have. I have. I'm jealous. I think the server crashed. That was what happened. Because uh, it's Gonzo. They're, uh, the game is Gonzo? The, the server died. The, nice the, the lobby, I mean. The lobby. They restarted it now. And the moment I hit hit the join button, it locked me out. <laughs> oh shit! They're gonna give us a new password then, I think. Yeah. Um. I mean, are people joining this one, or are we just leaving this server alone? I'm assuming. I'm assuming we're going back to this one. <laughs> I don't know. I'm sitting here while you guys figure it out. Actually, uh, do you mind? I'm gonna go get some something to snack on because, like, it's already late. Yeah, here, so you I'm go gonna ahead. go get something to eat. Be right back. All right, uh, boys and girls. I'm trying to log in here. I think it's a damn shame that we're having these server issues the very week we have the tournament because this has been going on for like a. So it says since March 9th, we've been experiencing ongoing issues with our lobby servers. The issue results in periods with lost connections, timeouts in the lobby. We are investigating the best ways to mitigate this. We have strong hypotheses. We are uncertain that at, at, of it at this time. We appreciate your patience. Keep in mind that this project is being run by volunteers. That is the me message from the devs on the welcome screen. Quite unfortunate. I'm hoping they manage to fix this before the the main events on the 23rd and the 24th because uh <laughs> it sucks that it expels all the players and the casters and we have to sit in the login screen trying to log in again i'm i'm still yeah also it doesn't help that my my face cam's bugging out damn can't really see me. At least I'm smiling in my my freezed freezed camera. There's a smile there. I maybe okay. I'm gonna try and restart the game again. Damn, my. It's a shame we also missed the, the gunslinger killing the command. It wasn't the gunslinger really, it was the the cooperation of all the units and the and the gunships in particular killing the, the cruiser's commander. And I'm back. And he's back. 
I'm I'm restarting my game. It usually helps uh, the desync problem. You should restart uh, your whole computer, but maybe <laughs> I <was>. did. <laughs> it was involuntary. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, let's see if uh, it's the same password. It is the same password. Yeah, it's the same lobby. Yeah, there you go. Let's see if op op same lobby. Oh, fantastic! It's capturing. There you go. It is. Capturing. Um, just a heads up. I'm probably gonna have to leave after this series. Okay, after pro versus it's, left. Yeah, it's gonna be too late for me. Like, I I didn't think it'd be this long. I can get the club in here, or uh, if he can't, maybe LDM, or or I can oh, cast yeah. by myself. Yeah. <laughs> OP caster, I, I believe. No, but uh, uh, yeah, LDM or anyone. Most of the casters, all of the casters are good. Oops, I think I closed the. Go. All right, I'm fixing something to eat. This is delicious. OP deliciousness. <laughs> it's gonna be ASMR eating stream. <laughs> <laughs> what what's they call it mukbang in uh, in Korea? Oh really? It's mukbang it stream. Mukbang? Yeah, <laughs> we're doing it. <laughs> I, I have my. Gonna... Yeah. What did you say? <laughs> I was gonna say, do you think pros are gonna three zero leftover? I think they will. I think they they're a very strong team. I there's no Randy and Daywalker. When they did the 2v2 tournament, they got to the finals, right? They're that good. And they yeah, and Randy, true, true. they've been playing together for years, right? For years. That's true. Yeah, Maybe yeah. when you saw they work as a 20 OS, he's probably 20 OS in, in team games. He's definitely top rated in 1v1s. No, so I, you... I, it's actually not Daywalker. I, I, I um, confuse him <laughs> with somebody else. Because <laughs> if you go to the tournament standings for like, from matches in, uh, in BA, tournaments in BA from like five, six years ago, it's Randy and Daywalker mm. there fighting each other in the finals almost every game. So he's definitely one of the best players. He yeah, just, yeah, no, he's, 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 he's a bit, uh, he, he, he's still learning the, the 8v8 meta, but he's embraced it. I've seen him just spam Janice Whistler every game and he's gaining OS like crazy. And I hate him for it. <laughs> I, <laughs> he's learned. I mean, if, if any, if any, if someday I really want to climb, I guess I'll do that too. Seems yeah, just easy. just smack the Janus Whistler button before they nerf them, which is gonna be never, I guess. Like you know, when they're gonna nerf them when they release on Steam, that's when it's gonna happen. Yes. Copium. <laughs> okay, know. so high gain is still trying to log in. Yeah. It sucks. Well, I wish I had the mod power so I can change uh, the options Please. while we're waiting. <laughs> oh yeah, yeah, that'd be kind of powerful. Yeah. I keep seeing uh, high gain logging in and logging out. Or high gain. Oh, Elmer join. High gain join. Okay. Okay, we got the full OP. squad. OP, the squad is here. OP man said. <laughs> God damn it. The chat is flaming me. <laughs> <laughs> I will let you know, chat, that I have a respectable baguette. Okay. <laughs> All right. We did not need to know that. <laughs> <laughs> Jesus. I have a respectable baguette. Please. Respect me. <laughs> <laughs> the balance off, always which is off. Allow commands while paused. Oh, that's a good one. I think that should be on for everyone, for every match. You can't use commands while the game is paused. That is smart. Mm -hmm. That way you can't cheese it by pausing and you're queuing up shit. But even then, is you're not allowed from pausing. Uh, I mean, I think in casual games it's fine. Yeah, but you're not. Yeah, again, you're not allowed to pause during uh, the match unless, like, someone drops or something happens. Oh, it's yeah, a, 
it's considered cheating because you, then you can pause for like five minutes and go watch the stream and see what happens, for example. And that's uh, yeah, that's or even worse. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, no, I, I agree. I agree. It's it's not really fair for sure. Oh, they're just organizing. All the teams are here. They're all ready, all right. and we're gonna be playing Altered Divide. The map with the 10k metal replay. Let's, let's see how Pro handles this map because they've been really greedy on the T2. But this map, I feel like, can you really go T2 without taking all the middle? No, you need the reclaim. You definitely need the reclaim, I think. We saw that with yeah. X Factor's team. They did, like, they didn't really they go for the reclaim, the reclaim as reclaim much. And then, yeah, they took the reclaim and then they get the fuck out. Yeah. Yeah, that's true. I, I, I think, I, generally, I think pro, team, pro teams got this. I give them like 80% chance of winning. 80%? Yeah. That's a huge amount. I, I mean, I do think they're them. favorites. I agree. But forget but they have Randy. He's the insane. real warrior monk. Randy is the OG of the warrior monk. I kind of agree. <laughs> It'd be interesting to see the spawn positions. We got Randy and Hygen spawning close to each other. Probably yeah, you gonna see, go they're cold. always cooking. They're always yeah. cooking something. We got the OP stress. That's why he doesn't want to reveal the replays. He said he's not uploading the replays until the main event. He doesn't oh, want to reveal really? the strats. Yeah, he's just gonna send them to the admin instead. So it's not publicly available. It's available to to, to in the club, Wait, I guess. How can you do? It? Oh, you mean these replays are not gonna be available? Yeah, he's he's not gonna upload them, so they can't uh, sneak check them. Yeah, but we're ruining everything. <laughs> yeah, but the stream isn't uh, as intrusive as a replay, right? A replay can watch it from any angle you want, right? Maybe that's I'll, true, that's I, true. I could be focusing on 80s shenanigans the entire time for, for, all, of, for all we care, right? <laughs> We're not <laughs> we going to see what they're this. cooking. <laughs> but yeah, I, I, I understand, Randy. I understand. Because there's the four teams right now. They're already seated into the main event. Who are going to be sitting here watching the, the replays and uh, yeah. getting all the OP strats. Okay, okay. You can uh, introduce. You think they're gonna try hard that much? I think they will. I think they will. Especially <laughs> some teams. <laughs> uh, we got. Teams, you can yeah. go top right. You wanna introduce? Uh, mm -hmm. From the red team. All right. In the wait, let me get your cam going. Let's see what you're saying. Okay, perfect. In the right top corner, in the red the color, it's Zekris with the armada. Flat ass commander. <laughs> To his left, we have eight a dimension gonna be going uh, core air here. In the middle of their team, Zolo hopefully will win his lane because middle is actually kind of important. On his left, we have CJ that really needs to rename so we can call him CJ again. I refuse to call him Genjuro again. <laughs> And of course, on the far left in yellow, it is the Birdman, the P Tac, and that's how you pronounce it, P Tac. Yeah, you heard it bird, here first. Bird in Polish, confirm. On the exactly. far bottom left, we got Elmer Fudd in the blue. Below him, we got Pro Shamone, the professional Shamone, and we got Daywalker in the dark blue. Their carry. If you're dark blue, that means you're the carry. On the right of him, we got High Gain, the green player. And below him, we got Randy, the leader of the squad, who's not blue for some reason. I guess he's not and gonna I'm be so carrying. And he, it's such, yeah. such a weird air start, though. Yeah. They're gonna be. What they, the, what the, the fuck top, are they doing? top side is doing a more standard start. Bot side is. Um, you're gonna be Ooh. down on mixes in the beginning, but I'm guessing they're gonna try and rely on the mid reclaim. To make up for it. I don't know and why why Randy would start there and go air though. It makes no sense. I guess just to boost. They just wanted to share BP from the commanders. Have it closer. Yeah, I guess. Oh, the tick. No, it didn't. Oh, it did, it did, it did die. <laughs> I was going to say, it's not dying. So AT is doing the same strat, but he's gifting one shuriken to each player. So they can individually shuriken their opponents. Like we see here with Zekrus. Yep. Shuriken in Mr. High game. I mean, we still got a lot of reclaim. Like, yeah. sure, they're kidding, but... Yeah, the reclaim is more reclaim. important. You can sneak it in very quickly. Yeah. And the rest bot doesn't show up on radar, so... They can just go off in a corner while the grunts fight. And reclaim all the rocks in the hidden spots. I mean, Hygen's trying to save his boys from... <laughs> 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 Desperately, but... You can't fight, uh... You can't fight, uh... Yeah. 
The zappy boy. If you have like six, seven grunts, you can kill the zappy boy from the sky, from the ground, I mean, like that. Oh, oh, slow. Okay, very OP. You just focus very it. OP. Over here. If you go in one by one, though, you're definitely not killing the shuriken. Like Elmer was doing here. <laughs> okay, I... we see that actually Shaman is the one expanding to the other mixes. So I, and, okay. there's, and there's like one tick in the back. Yeah. So they know they're up to shenanigans. Yeah. It's crazy. I see what their pl plan here is. They have Daywalker, Elmer, and Highgain being the, the frontliners. Pro Shamon is gonna be in the back taking all the mixes, and Randy's gonna be the air player. There's another tick here coming in from uh, Pitak. Is he gonna what, get any what, damage done? Wait, a new lab? I don't get what they're doing though. Mm. Oh, they're reclaiming air. Yeah. I think. Why though? In their mind, they're done with the early Shuriken raids, right? But... Yeah, he's switching to vehicles, but. I don't Maybe. like it because it got spotted. I, I yeah. would have been, I think it was better if it wasn't seen. Yeah, it definitely got spotted. I think... No, uh, they, they know, they know. Yeah, I think... Maybe they're going for a T2 vehicle. That's why they're going for oh, Armada that, Oh, yeah, he might... Yeah, you think he's gonna reclaim it instantly after Worker? Yeah. It's possible. That is possible. Because uh, right now, Hygen's only 1v1, right? AT is air. He doesn't have to. He doesn't have to worry about high game losing. Yeah, but left is two v one though. Yeah. How the hell is he gonna hold? Oh no, no, Shaman is making units behind. Yep, and okay, it's vehicles. Yeah, okay. It's very strong. So since so they they're don't... gonna forego air to go T two, maybe yeah. it's possible, but it's also very dangerous. Nah, he's going for Whistler Janus. Never mind. Randy has yeah, decided against it. He's going for the meta instead. <laughs> yeah, but I guess that means they still have like. Uh... Uh, they they have <laughs> they have a transport. I, I just I just saw a funny comment. Feast your eyes. Exclusive pro tech. <laughs> 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 it's true. You only get it here, boys. Exclusive pro tech. Let's look at the hey. reclaim here. This Hello. is one one or two zero. Two zero. Uh, two zero. Okay, pro looking strong, guys. On yeah, the pro S. looking mighty strong. Sir. Bullshock team is giving the the huge, let's say, revelation right now and is winning against X Factor team 2-1. They are going to the best oh. of four games. Wow. Oh, wow. Is, yes. uh, is Zhao playing with them? Who, sorry? Zhao? No, it's playing. With, they are playing with uh, Little Panda, with Shoto Nico. Okay. Oh, so, and... OP, OP Panda. OP Panda, yes. They are playing with a lot of guys, so yeah. Oh, Keep you posted, guys. Going All to right. the Thank you. Yeah. Pitak is looking for the trade there. Yeah. I'm not sure why. Red team, it seems like red team got all the reclaim though, early on. Look at that. 19, Do you think so? It says 19% uh, ahead. Oh, I have the OP layout. Oh, you're the... right. Yeah, you have OP layout. I don't have OP. Yeah, yeah they produced four, 3x for K metal. It's uh, They got That's map true. control essentially, because uh, Shaman was in the back making mixes instead of uh, mm. sending units to help with the reclaim. And with the fact that AT gave a shuriken to every one of his teammates, they got to secure the reclaim very happily and easily, while killing all the enemy's grunts. So they yeah, gained map might, control. This might be a good game for leftovers. Yeah. I, uh, you know, I'm, I'm gonna give him a 50% chance of winning this. I'm giving him 50%. 50% chance. Yeah. <laughs> I'm being they generous. Went from, they <laughs> went from 20 to 50. Yeah. <laughs> I mean, that's more than double. Am I, not, am I wrong or am I wrong? <laughs> Yeah, no, you're right. It's just I'm surprised by the numbers. They fly all over the place. That's <laughs> <laughs> some crazy ass numbers. I, uh, I mean, they're called <laughs> no, leftovers. I like it, I like it. <laughs> they're called leftovers for a reason. All right. I'm not saying yeah, leftovers was so bad. Leftovers was all delicious. They three zero slow team. No, not they, slow. Uh, X Factor's uh, team. X Factor's team. That is true. But X Factor's team is also essentially uh, <laughs> Rusty leftovers lobsters. of a different kind. <laughs> 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 oh yeah, I guess they are. Uh, it's banter, boys. I love them all. I play with them every day. No, no, no ill intentions. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah. Don't worry, don't worry. We, uh, we, we don't flame people we don't like. If we don't yeah. flame you, watch out. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> I love you, choice. I love you in chat, choice. You're my favorite. <laughs> I'm joking. Um, Randy just like Janice whistling, and uh, Shamon. Uh, I'm sorry, Highgate reclaimed his lab. And he's going into MOBA mode, moving his commander. I mean, he's towers. just trying to, yeah, yeah, he's gonna do that tower that actually outranges most of 
everything. But they but, have artillery. Yeah, so and it's Cortex not artillery good. at that. So not only does it count at the towers, but it can count at the unit. Yeah, he needs to he needs to stall for just a moment longer. Get the tower up and running. Oh, oh, nice! He got the digan off on the centurion. Yeah, that's really good. But that's actually commander... not easy to do. His command is getting very low. Yeah. Uh oh. Uh oh. Yeah, that's yeah, a calm bit much. Is, uh, on the verge of dying. As the LLTs yeah. are saving him. Oh, oh, he's walking away. Yeah, he's dead. He, that's a smart move to walk away, though. Yeah, it was smart. Like, I don't, the tower is not even. Even if the tower gets done, though, it's never going to be enough. Yeah. So. Uh, yeah, he and needs unfortunately, to though, the the command reclaim that's, is closer to Zekros. That might be game on this side, but the left uh, side's inverted. Like it's they're pushing really hard yeah. here. Because they're going T2. Pitak is greed in the T2 at uh, 8 minutes. I mean, if they pull it off, though, if they don't die from this yeah. and get some of the reclaim, it's and GG. Pitak has, has maybe like 6, 7 cons making windmills at the same time. He is going very greedy. I so would actually right now give leftovers 80% chance of winning. 80%? <laughs> right? <laughs> yeah. They are, they are only ahead 15% on metal produced. I, I, it's it's not about that. It's about their game plan. I like I the mean, T2 and their winning right side, and I don't think left side is gonna collapse. Nope. Uh, Randy they're doing... is also going T2 at the same time. Yeah, yeah. They're gonna they're gonna be co-oping it with high game. It's gonna happen here. Yeah. I mean, but uh, yeah, it with the whole team, uh, this is very weak though. Their their side, Randy's side. They only have yeah, a few. Yeah, but they walkers there to kind of yeah. Yeah, he's pressuring on the sides. He's pressuring. He's pressuring with the. With grunts though, against pounders, they hard counter for grunts. Yeah, they do hard counter grunts. Yeah. Oh, was CJ going for comp? No, 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 he's not going for comp. No, trade. no, no. He's not. It, it almost looked like it, but he's out of a uh, jammer range. All they have to do is delay. They don't actually have to do any ra real trades. They but delay. they don't really have anything to delay with anymore, except yeah. commanders. Yeah, commanders in the jamming field. That's that's about yeah. it. But they, they, they already have T2 units out, Bull. they're making bulls, yeah. They have a bull out, so suddenly it's not that easy to push. What? Did, did he suicide? I think that was a suicide, right? It must have been. There's no unit in range to kill him. But why? He, they to reclaim? The yeah. battle? Yeah, I yeah, don't know. Reclaim. He's reclaiming with a worker. Maybe it's a bit it risky, because you can see the commander exploding in the, in the fog of war. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And they can even see the reclaim. They, they zoom in, they can see the, the bar emptying. They yeah, know. that's true. They even know something's oh, yeah, up. Yeah, yeah. I mean, they and, see but, the bull. <laughs> yeah, they do see the bull. I think but they know what's up. Reclaiming one whole commander, you get essentially one extra bull. And, and a bit yeah, of to spare. It's, it's not really the worth it. Is, yeah, I think the commander is worth more for sure. Yeah, definitely. The commander can dig on 20 bulls and survive. If he's lucky. Yeah. Bulls are hard to, bulls are hard to They are hard though. to dig on and yet we have seen it. We have seen the <laughs> Zekrus dig yeah. on in like eight bulls that one game. <laughs> yeah, with cloak you can, but like if if they have radar coverage and you don't they make sure you don't have a jammer, it's really hard. Yeah. Yo, especially he's armada too, he can make an armada jammer, which is very OP. Very long range and it's cloaked. He can dig on anything. As long as they don't have spam. And What's is he gonna go for Degans? I don't think so. He's gonna run. Uh, he's, just chill. he's hidden from the radar where he stands. Oh. That's so fighting. Oh! Boom. There you got CJ's That's... commander. And now there's no commanders in the way to defend. Yeah, but they there's just no rush in. left to push. That is true. Oh, that is true. It's like... That's... It's like too little too late, I think. Look at... Look at the Shamon's base. Right, Elber well. has nothing down here. So they're doing the same thing that Randy and uh, High Gain are doing. Yep. One guy reclaims everything they have and gives gives it to the higher rated guy. Essentially, oh, they 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 carry. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, they're the focusing the resources. Yeah, no, but it makes sense. Yeah, it's, it's it's a good plan. I'm not. And if they need to micro more, they just give more units to the, the guy who has no buildings to no no macro to worry about. Right? Yeah. Uh, yeah, exactly. The issue right now is left side. They need to go T2 units ASAP, yeah. I think. The, the medium tanks and the Janus aren't going to do anything against this. The bulls are too strong. They counter them hard. And if they don't attack and they sit, they just get pounded by Mausers at the same time. So they're constantly sure. getting pushed back a tiny bit. Death by Plus, a thousand cuts or uh, just a giant cudgel to your head. <laughs> exactly. Plus they got all the reclaim behind. 
yeah. we get the other commander like it's a lot but they is that him. a tsar on the right side or am i dreaming is that a big boy that it is, is a big boy that's a tsar that is a big boy tsar Look i think it's go. an underrated i actually think it's an underrated unit i think it's yeah. tsar is actually kind of strong i think if you make one <laughs> if you make one and micro it properly yes <laughs> No, I think you do two or three, and then a lot of medium, Ooh. like, cover, covering units. I think Ooh. they just become, uh, they, they become you don't, you don't want too many. I, I, I agree, you don't want yeah. too many. But I think, like, one or two with your tigers, a huge difference. Uh, like they become obsolete too quickly, in my opinion. They're good early on to kill all T1 units, and good at killing commanders, because of the AoE, right? Even if they cloak, think, you can still hit yes, them. Yes, but I do think they're good against bulls, if you have tigers with them. Mm. I think alone they kind of suck, but like mixed in with a decent... Like 5 to 1, 5 tigers, 1 tsar, is way better than like 7 tigers. Randy... Randy is putting bulls on repeat. Meanwhile... Uh... He's making quakes up here, AT. I'm scared for pro, team pro. I don't see how they win this. Yeah. I uh, I think... I told you, 80%, baby. Yeah. Look at... Zekru's doing the exact same thing as Randy's doing. We reclaimed his stuff, and now he's just boosting AT's T2 lab. Yep. Yeah. They're, they're, they're cooperating. Vibing. Yeah. And... And all so the scouts are getting sniped, so they yeah. have no vision. CJ's making it fusion. He reclaimed his lab. He's scaling. Red team is very scaling. far ahead in eco. Right? Both in eco produced and the current eco income. Yeah, they are ahead for sure, and they're getting so much reclaim all over the place. And look at the map control rough. they're gaining on right side. Oh, 80 by 2 is his commander. He missed so many shots! What yeah, the he fuck? Did. <laughs> <laughs> He's got old man aim, don't be mean. <laughs> old man aim. He missed, he missed like three shots. <laughs> That's funny though. Hey, I wouldn't. I would. Definitely not make Jags against uh, Zars though. <laughs> the AoE is too strong against those uh, tiny units. Datewalk is yeah. poked up here in mid, but it's mostly just T1 defenses and they're gonna get melted by the by the Quakers here. Destroyed here. And Daywalker does still not have T2. In fact, most of the team does not have T2. They're slowly building up the T2 mixes here. A bit too slowly, I think. Yeah. They only have one con boosting it, and it's as a single bot con, which takes a long time for it to walk up to it. <laughs> I, yeah. I, but they, I think they're worried they're gonna lose if they if they scale too hard. Whereas yeah, uh, on red team, look at them, they have all their mechs upgraded already. Yeah, they're like, they, they they're so far ahead right now. They even have a fusion done, oh, they're vibing. They have a advanced geo done, a fusion yeah. done, they're vibing right now. They have 80 83% more energy income, 83% more metal income, it is perfect. Dude, it is, it yeah, went up from 50% yeah, to 90% for me. 95 even. They, yeah, they, have to, they have to do a giga feed, a giga feed for uh, Randy's team, to for the professional team to get back into this game. Yep. And it's not looking likely because even the unit comp they're using, like they're not, they're never gonna die far away from where they control. Yeah. So I don't see them giving or feeding any metal here. And you see, ah, oh, Daywalker, he's just getting bombarded right yeah. now. Not much you can do. And it's not like with T3s where you can, uh, you can kill one very expensive unit and then res it uh, to get back at them. Right? It's just a bunch of shitty units. Like Quakers are not expensive. 400 metals. Even if they get all oh, of this res or reclaim, it doesn't matter. You're just producing the same amount in like two minutes and they'll be right back at you killing you. Mm, and they're gonna yep. lose their geo here, which means they're gonna be overly reliant on windmill energy. But that geo is a small one though, but yeah. It is a small one, but it means they also can't back. they can't also upgrade it. Is the problem if it's dead. <laughs> While the uh, red team's uh advanced geo is fully alive and protected. They're just losing map control completely. This is looking very over. For them. And the enemy is scaling harder than yeah. they are. Like the, I see another fusion on the map. Randy's making one, but it's making very slowly. And it's looking rough. Boom. And that looks they even walk worse. They walk too. Oh, I'm mean, Elmer. Oh I mean, my god. Oh, oh. Elmer not to hit the deck. Oh, he survived. Shrek this... is saving his ass. But the, the thing is, they're popular. losing. They're losing. Not only are they losing units on the left, but they're even not even getting the reclaim. Look, they're just gobbling up yeah. those tank breaks. It's so horrible. Like they're getting fed. Oh, they're so far gone. Randy? Oh, also Randy. Gonna get sniped. Oof. 
Oof, that's a lot of Quakers and uh, one Zar. Uh, Just so ground attack Zar. him. Can they see? Uh, he, he, he's no, not they can't. Gonna, he doesn't have the vision, I think. Oh, they, they don't have a radar vehicle. <laughs> it's a shame. Nope. <laughs> I mean, they did, but I think they pulled it to the left yeah. to kill Daywalker. Both teams I'm do have three didn't commanders, go harder. but Zlos and uh, Zlos and ATS commands are defending. The cruise commander is the only one that's a bit exposed. But even then, like the, the wind condition, it's almost non-existent for for blue team here. The I only mean, way, yeah. I, I think it's over. I do yeah. sincerely believe it's over. It's just too much snowball right now. They're getting some reclaim, but that's not enough. It's just a one con worker, and it's gonna get sniped. <laughs> I, I, I. For Elmer, he's been spotted. <laughs> they're going. I think they're going for the win condition here. Pitak seeing ping in the commanders. Oh Pitak. really? I don't think they need look. In, CJ's even prepping a bombing run. Like oh yeah, that's gonna be the nail in the coffin. They can't even deal with the ground units. Imagine a bombing run. Yeah. Yeah, they don't have any air anymore. And uh, they walk lost. When he lost his geo, that was a third of his energy income, by the way. And now he's losing even more wins. Yeah. All, he has, all he has is T1 mixes and windmills. He's, he's and a, in and rough a dream. state. He does yeah. have a dream, though. <laughs> a dream, yeah. a <laughs> dream that's about to end very violently. <laughs> yeah, he did get all the all oh. the um, Quakers. But I mean, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> that's a yikers so moment. Yeah, it's oh, sad. Oh, oh, here comes the air. Here they are. That's a GG Choice moment, Junior isn't it? with the bombing run. Oh, they, res yep. they resigned. They're not giving them satisfaction of the bombing run. I don't even think they saw it. <laughs> nah. I mean, they figured they were so far behind. The enemy had so many T2 units and they barely had any to begin with. And they left so many, so much reclaim behind. Yeah, but they built, interestingly enough, they built T2 units that you don't really trade. Like, they built all, almost only long range. So, even so, unless you get overwhelmed by units, you don't lose. Any of them, you know what I mean? Yeah. Like you just poke, 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 and you don't really hard a trade, which I think is a smart move to do, right? Yep. That's what I personally try to do. The only reason sometimes it doesn't work is if you overestimate how much damage you're going to do, and the other guy just rushes at your artillery, and you don't have enough to push them back. You need to have enough in front, but then only artillery, and you're going to shred them, right? Lobby. Oh, I disconnected. Very happy. <laughs> You're not the only one. I see a few others left. Yeah. Lobby. It's gonna be the final pro versus. Uh, yeah, pro final versus... match. We're going the distance. Wait, how yeah. many rounds are supposed to be played today? Five. Yeah. You guys are delusional. <laughs> who, who made this format is delusional. <laughs> <laughs> I could have told you. He could have asked me. <laughs> If I can log in, is it gonna instantly log me out? It sure is. Hopefully. <laughs> well, we're only like five people. Oh, I'm out too. I got kicked. It's also the dragging out the, the tournament itself, is the constant getting kicked and having to log back in. You know, it was going, I mean, yeah. it was going fine sure. with the first set of matches, and none of yeah. us got dropped. It is what it is. <clears throat> but yeah. Uh, Flash is asking about the standings. I should uh, post. I, I have to re re re. Uh... We're still in the game, so I can join. Oh, the, I think the lobby died. I think it's a lobby that died yeah. completely. Yeah. Right, then uh, thinking that. I just ping pin this message. As long as my stream doesn't crash again, I don't have to pin it again. <laughs> I should be good, I think. I'm gonna, I'm gonna go to the boop, boop. it's not the one I want to click uh pro Randy private battle uh did they give us the password or is it the same lobby I think it it's could probably, be good to change the lobby it might be the same lobby yeah it is the same
Mm-hmm. No clue. Nobody knows. Nobody knows where we're going here. Maybe it's better to do a new lobby now. Mm. I think it's just server wide, not just the lobbies. Some lobbies are yeah. extra laggy. That is true. Yeah, I have no idea. <clears throat> I just wish we could get this going. <laughs> 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 it's um, getting so freaking late. It's seven o'clock, sir. You go to bed early nowadays? No, no, no. I I had some stuff I wanted to do, oh. and this is taking off. <laughs> On a Sunday. Mm. <laughs> yeah, you know it. I hadn't planned to. I I honestly thought we had like maybe three hours. We would be done by six. But oh my god, <laughs> no. How long did your tournament take? Like seven hours, right? And I had way more, I had way fewer matches lined up than you guys. Yeah. Though. That's why when I saw the lineup, I was like, <laughs> you guys going to be here all day. I'm, I'm asking for a new co-caster in the, in the stream Discord. See, see if anyone signs up. Yeah, I'm sure. You're, you're very charming, especially your face. Oh, yeah. I mean, look at me. You see that smile? <laughs> My God! I know, I know. It's uh, me. I'm, I'm gonna wave. Me gay, like I'm gonna wave at the camera. Oh, it's no, it, it froze again when I moved. Oh shit! <laughs> Barry Cavill. Now at least we know you have a brother. <laughs> I'm secretly <laughs> British. This is my British accent. What about? Wait, Cavill's British? Yeah, I didn't even know. What about? You didn't know? What a ball? What a ball? What a uh, ball? What? <laughs> what? 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 But okay, yes. Randy's gonna send assassins after us. <laughs> Jesus. <laughs> All right. Two. Oh, this was the password. Yes, it was. All right, I am in. Don't zone. join the goddamn queue. <laughs> <laughs> it automatically makes me join. Goddamn it! I'm gonna change that setting. Uh, always spectator B. There we go. Now we waiting. The next map is gonna be Tangerine Remake, and this map has a lot of this energy. This is interesting. It's an interesting map, and we haven't seen it today, so I'm very happy we get to cast it. Oh, here we go. Vote to start, boys. So it's a lot of shenanigans that can happen here. Uh, with the Geos, you can get them up very quickly because of the energy reclaim. So if you start bots and make like four res bots, you get the Geo up like that. And that's what Chisato Absolutely. likes to do. If Chisato also, sees a Geo, he's going to make res bots. That's just how he is. He smells, he smells the energy coming. He smells the E. Plus on this map, you get a lot of reclaim in the middle. Uh, I think it's 750 or almost yeah. 800. Yes. In rocks, but it's in the water. So you got to use your commander. Or MP, MP, I guess. Yeah. Commander would be faster. But if you're hugging the enemy commander, you could also add even more metals to mid. <laughs> <laughs> Another 2.5k metal, very OP. For sure. I wonder how the sonic position. Oh, this is not what I expected. I almost expected somebody to be here and just go for oh, it, you know? Yeah. I've seen, I've mean... seen starts where one player starts here. And by yeah. seen, I mean that was me. I built a lab right here, naval lab, and then the guy behind me gave me the mixes and some windmills. And then you could just win the naval lane instantly. Because they're not expecting it to come. But it's also risky because oh, you have uh, yeah, one yeah. guy one guy giving you mixes. But, but it's narrow yeah, yeah, enough yeah. narrow enough in mid that you can defend. And then once you've cleared out the sea, which is very quick by the way, you get the commander reclaim and the naval and the lab reclaim. You can yeah, no, swap to cooking. sea planes. Yeah, yeah. Then you're cooking for real, for sure. Oh, there's also... Oh, I just noticed the Easter Island reclaims the heads over here. That's a lot of metals, if you see. Bam. Ah, there's a uh, lot of metals. How much is it? Each one is 225 metal. Each one? Yep. That's, that's a ton, yeah. That's a ton. Even in the sea, you see there's 167, yeah. 167 times 3. That's <laughs> a lot. This map is reclaim rich. Oh, bless you. And look at wind, min 5, max 25. 
Windmill spam on this yeah, map. Yeah, the wind is well worth it. insane. I'm also sa almost sad for the water boys with only 20 title. Yeah, it's a sad state. <laughs> no one's going to be East Stalin on this map, that's for sure. And if you are East Stalin, you have only yourself to blame. Is it some. I mean, uh, is it you even worth it? Which is that good win? I mean, stable energy is always worth it, I think. Especially I mean, such, yeah, no, so true. cheap. And if it, if it reaches T2 stage, then definitely you have to go for an AGO. AGO is the most efficient out of all of them. And it's, it's one. Oh, yeah, yeah. It's... Advanced Geo is OP. Let's see, what's they going to do? No, no, they're going to do a cop. I thought they were going to do a cop. Oh, they they uh, swapped out. They swapped out yeah, the looking... for Flash. <clears throat> Well, P -tag do... was technically P -tag was technically um, the substitute. Yes, the substitute. Yeah. So I'm gonna do. Uh, I'm gonna introduce uh, the top right here. We got the uh, Flash. He is the main player for the team. P -tag was just a substitute. He was doing something else. Um, maybe he was stuck in an FFA lobby. I don't know. To the left <laughs> of him, we got Genjiro, aka CJ, and the AFF clan, who's not. Uh, he does, he's not, uh, he doesn't have the, the, the tag for some reason. We got Zekrus in blue starting a hover lap. That is interesting. I have not seen that before. We got Zlomium starting an Armada vehicle lap. And to the top left, we got Eight Dimensions himself. Our uh, Cortex vehicle lap. Uh, sorry, bot lap. <laughs> uh, standard right. start for him. Bottom left. In the bottom left corner in the orange is high gain with those sexy ships to his right. We got OP Daywalker probably going to push really hard here. That's what I expect to see. Uh, to his right, Elmer Fudd. Below him, we're going to go right ahead with the pro, the Randy. Also going to open bots. It makes sense. As you said, a lot of trees on this map. And last but not least, Shaman in the bottom right. Going to go air. It's a safe air spot, so it makes sense. Uh, but I'm, I, I want to see that hover lab again. I'm, he's cooking. You know, I think the hovers actually could work. Because he's not going to have any naval opposition. See, the problem with going hovers in the naval lane is they always lose to ships. But he doesn't have any naval opposition. There's no one here. Because of the spawn yeah, positions, right? Yeah, but they're going right? to scout it. They're going to scout it. They're going to scout it, yes. He's going to be able to take the mixes. He's going to be able to fight land and see if that happens. One one no, of the problems will be uh, He's tricks. going straight. He's going straight for Shaman's base, though. Oh, he did see it. But it's scouted. It, it, it is yeah. scouted. So. The shurikens are just going to stop it. And you see, uh, CJ is take, uh, taking the middle. He, like, yeah. fast walked to the middle. Torpedo launcher. That is, yep. that is good. Making sure that nobody else can get there. Getting like the Mexus and the reclaim. Very valuable for red team. Uh, sorry, for blue team. Meanwhile, uh, high gain. Making some herrings, anti-airships. I guess he's not expecting any opposition on sea. Except the uh, the single uh, single seeker hovercraft from uh, Zekrus coming in. It's not very strong. It's like a tick. but uh, It's like an expensive bad tick. Yeah. <laughs> and it's dead. Yep. <laughs> it's dead. But, uh, um... I think if he wasn't scouted... I think the, the hovers could have uh, massed units on the right and attacked Shaman, but now that they've scouted it, he's going to have shurikens ready for it. He has one shuriken, though. Is that enough? I think it is, sadly. Yeah, for one single seeker, definitely. Wait, he uh, doesn't have a radar, right? He doesn't see this coming. No, but the commander is flying there. Oh, he's going to spot it. Oh, yeah, he's going to spot it now. Yep. Boom, it's in. There he is. Yep. And he doesn't even need the shuriken. He's just going to kill him with the commander. <laughs> Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. Whoa. Holy shit, <laughs> he was playing Damn. with fire. That does a lot of damage to air units. I did not know that. I guess they don't yeah, have that any... That was a lot, yeah. They don't have any debuffs against air. Yeah, they don't have... They do full damage to air units. Oh, wow. really? Yeah. Seeker. Look at that. No, not complete garbage. Yeah, Just exactly. mainly garbage. If okay. he had two of them there, <laughs> Shabon would have been surprised. <laughs> I bet you would have expected that they uh, they do like decrease damage to air. So high gain, just making herrings. Herrings, they, the good thing they got for going for them. They're cheap, they're long range, and they're anti-air. Plus they have uh, radar and sonar built in. Yeah, they're annoying to deal with. That's super annoying. Yeah, so you can just... Curiously not pushing. He's just chilling on his lane. And he's making frigates here? I guess he you can't know what's push interesting on this map? The middle section, there's no reason to push forward except map control. 
Yeah. Like you don't get any mechs in the middle, which is actually interesting. But once you are pushed all the way over here, that's, that's just a step away from the enemy's base, right? Yeah, yeah, you don't want to leave all the ground, but it also doesn't gain you anything if you just, like, take the middle. And he's getting harassed by ships, so... Yeah, uh, he can't really push. The, the moment uh, the moment Elmer, I'm mean, sorry, Hagen makes a single destroyer, it's, it's all good. Oh, he's reclaiming the naval lab. It makes sense. Gonna, he's just gonna eco, yeah. he's probably gonna swap to sea planes or amphibious. One of those. I mean, nobody's gonna go on the sea without him knowing about it. Yeah. He has too much so... map control. And with the with yeah, the it's... with the herrings, you can shoot down any transports or any units flying over. Slow, fast T2, and a mine yeah. layer. Interesting. interesting. <laughs> Classic. <laughs> Are we gonna be seeing uh, heavy mines? A man mines? after my heart. A oh, man no. after my heart. Mines, baby. Just light mines. That's sad. Zekrus missed one of these mixes. He forgot this mix. Oh, CJ is pinging him to make it. <laughs> <laughs> he, just, he just like. <laughs> he just went past it. I mean, yeah, he's not yeah. investing in naval. And the, I, I uh, can't want to see Shaman go naval though, just deny everything. Mm. Or maybe not Shaman, maybe Randy is better, but is Randy going T2? Yeah, That's Randy is bot T2. He's already. already done with T2. Yeah. And he's going oh. Sprinters? Is this They've in been the club? I've heard. I've Have heard they've been mm. buffed. <laughs> nope. <laughs> Wait, Sprinters haven't been buffed? No, you've been misinformed, sir. <laughs> really? Somebody so told me. Zekrus going hovers means he can fight from the from the mid side. It's a bit of a surprise yeah. for them. All of a sudden he shows up. But uh, uh, yeah, just put a radar and you see it coming. Yeah. Like it doesn't matter. Minor feed here. Minor feed. One sweeper <laughs> and one uh, one possum. <laughs> yeah. Oh, it's actually gonna spot the T2 though. He showed the sprinter. Oh yeah. And uh, high gain landing, sprinter. doing a shore landing here. This is his. Uh, <laughs> oh, this D day so for high gain. <laughs> This is so annoying to deal with, actually. Oh, hey, is he going for a hug? Oh, the block! Got you know, AT could have just hugged them and killed them. And then the reclaim would have yeah, been on this side of the map. I don't think he can take it, though, with the boats. Just one That's one, thing. one frigate and a bunch of cheap herrings. They don't have no, a lot like, of HP. Can, can he actually take the reclaim? Like, yeah, sure, it's on his side, but how, yeah. how, how does he clean out the boats? It's... It is difficult, to be sure. It is difficult. If he had... Like, he's going to get it shrikens. eventually. Yeah, he's gonna get shrikens. it eventually. Yeah, but it's gonna but take it's him a while. Delayed, and at that point, it might not be as worth. But yeah, it's even worse to have an enemy commander on your shore, posturing, taking up space, and high. <laughs> oh, look, it's low making heavy mines. <laughs> 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 so they they are taking the geos. Look, yeah, AD Zekrus Zekrus also going for a vehicle T two at the same time as low. That is interesting. And they can There's just upgrade no... them to Aegeos. But Randy, oh. Randy's already upgrading his to A Geo. And uh Shamon has got this Geo. They're upgrading mixes. I guess they're going uh, they're going greedbuild. They porked up the lanes. That's they how they air. won their two first games. They went early T2 greedy. Yeah. That's how they won their first games. Uh but this time leftovers are doing the same thing. Yeah. They're not behind. So it's a much closer match from the get-go. So even so though they've given up some map control over mid, it doesn't matter because there's no metals here. No, no, no yeah, yeah, yeah. That, yeah, it doesn't matter so like much. how far forward you're pushed yeah. unless you have like units that kite well and you need the space. Yeah, if they had, if but they had, say, Mausers on this line, they could kill Daywalker instantly if they made like 10 Mausers, I think. But they're going oh, yeah, of course, of ambassadors, course, yeah, yeah. but yeah, but that's that's a ways away. They'll have time to react to it, right? And Daywalker yeah, yeah, just yeah. going for grunt spam like a 1v1er. Very OP. <laughs> Howls from Randy. No, I wonder if spiders would be good on this lane if you go over the, these rocks, right? I, I like the spider here. Yeah. Also, you get to snipe everything on the water surface. And you could uh, shuffle in between, like over the ridges. So you can oh, yeah, uh, you could just micro. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah and shoot. So <laughs> High cane still I'm... being very annoying. <laughs> I, I love it. He's he's just he's just building. What's he cooking? What's he cooking behind? Nothing. He's he's a uh, his workers are idle. He's, he just put his sliders all the way down. I guess <laughs> he's, he's feeding his behind. team. <laughs> he's chillaxed. Yeah. I guess he's feeding Randy and uh, he's hoping for the T2. Yeah. The team battery. Counter harpoons. <laughs> a counter urchin. <laughs> That's funny. 
I mean, why but, would you make urchins though? Oh, uh, for a commander. Oh, yeah. Yeah, commander or any amphibious units, potentially. But the commander is the worst, I think. They, get, they got, they got hounds. Uh, sprinters. From. Uh, All the sprinters OP. Flash. I mean, <laughs> what did they do? They killed, they killed the uh, the radar bot and then yeah, died themselves. <laughs> <laughs> just, make bonds. just make pawns instead, honestly. <laughs> or ticks. Ticks or pawns. Much you better. Think, no, I think that, I don't think the sprinter is that bad, is it? You know, sprinter. How, how much does it cost? Like 200 something metals. Okay. 190, 4,600 <laughs> energy. <laughs> they have 650 <laughs> HP. They'll die to LLTs. Literally, if you have five LLTs, doesn't matter how many how many sprinters they send at you, they all die. They are not very good. Those are painful. They what they're good against are like uh, heavy, expensive units that they can surround, you, right? Ooh, that rocket hit! That, the ambassador hit. That, That's actually impressive. Three hounds in one shot. That was good. <laughs> Jesus. Damn. I was low liking those ambassadors. You see, making here just bulls. So okay, they upgrade, upgrade, oh, upgrading the the agios over here. They really are just yeah. scaling. Like nobody's making any real units. Randy's Everybody's just making scaling. some hounds and spy bots, and that's about it. Like, he's giving them to Elmer while he's macroing. Right? This is very. Uh, so I'm surprised. This is very such a st like a stationary match. This is such an 8v8 game. Yeah. <laughs> Shamone is just walking up and killing all the defenses and all the mexes in the water with his commander. <laughs> I guess that's a good, <laughs> good efficiency, I suppose. Oh, yeah. Highgate finally decided to play the game. Has made an Ooh. amphibious complex. Oh, that's spicy. I like it. I think we're gonna be seeing a lot of salamanders this game. And he's getting that's a lot a of point. team overflow, so he'll have energy, but not metal. Oh, he cancelled. He cancelled. He cancelled? Why? Wow. That's I so knew. juicy. I kind of uh, like that. I mean, he could, he could go for a T2 naval lab just to get the con so he could upgrade all the mixes and then reclaim it instantly and then go amphibious or seaplanes. That's so uh, slow, I think. I mm, I guess I it's mean, good. But... It's slow, but he's not doing anything. <laughs> no, he's making he is converters. feeding his team. He's no, but he is feeding the team. Like, yeah, it's true, it's not but he, nothing. he could feed even more if he had uh, T2 Maxes, <laughs> right? <laughs> yeah, but it's a big investment. I mean, you get it back, but you yeah. know what I mean. Yeah. It takes a lot of BP, but a lot of time. The fact that he doesn't have an opponent, and the fact that his entire team is mostly just idling, that both teams are mostly just idling. Yeah, but it means the time. rest of his team is ecoing faster. Yeah. Because they need way more AA. Yeah. Like, that was, a, that was a lot of AT's fighters, though, right? Oh, I think the lobby crashed. Yep, the lobby crashed. Fuck. <laughs> okay. Lobby crashed? I'm still in. Yeah, yeah, you, we are in, but uh, the lobby is dead, itch, right? The the lobby system is a bit separated from the main game. Oh, you mean the uh, yeah, not the game, but the lobby. Yeah, yeah. the lobby. That doesn't yeah. matter. This is the last game of the series, anyway. Okay, Zekri is getting pushed, but he has bolts. This should be fine. Shaman, is he gonna get sniped down there? He's getting owned by your favorite unit, the Splinter. <laughs> yeah, good at killing commanders. There you go. <laughs> See? It is good at something. <laughs> yeah, I mean, you could have <laughs> accomplished the same thing with pause and takes, I'm gonna be honest. <laughs> I'm surprised they're not building anything to deal with the tick spam right now. It looks very annoying. Yeah. Oh, Juno they, they do is have dropping. Juno, yeah, yeah. I we just saw it. Yeah, From it actually cleaned blocker. the mines. Yeah. It actually cleaned the mines too, so that's really annoying for Slow. Slow is just making dragon's teeth now. Nope, oh, not fast enough. It's a lot of, there's a lot of Sheldons actually. The Shellys and the Arbiters. There's not really any defenses except Shelly, the, the giant horde of uh, bulls. Yeah, Shellys. Not great, but not no. bad. I think they're good, but they're so slow at pushing because they're low, low damage. Like, you yeah. need so many for it to work. They're good for skirmishing, and I think you have to commit yeah. a lot. Like, blue team has to commit a lot to kill them, which Ooh, does it so... Did you see? Never oh. mind, they don't have to commit anything. They just have to sit there and shoot them. My god. That Those was lucky, though. That yeah. was super lucky. Like, usually you don't hit anything with ambassadors. Yeah. I, I mean, just slow, slow is spending all his APM microing the ambassador, so... Oh, friendly fire! <laughs> oh, the oh, D-gun! <laughs> three bulls? So, I think 
the the ambassadors killed two bulls and the high gain Deegan the, the remaining three. <laughs> oh my god, and now the Juno blocking the tick spam, blocking everything. Oh, oh a platypus? That's One single surviving bulls. platypus. Oh. Yeah, but it's gone. It's gone. Yeah, it's gone, so. They're going T3s? Oh, they're Marauders. going Marauders. They do have a lot of energy and they're sharing all the metals with Randy. All those oh, AGs. They're cooking. Oh, but look, look, look at the bombing run preparing on the top side. Mm. How many? They, Six. I don't know, bombers. but like, they know yeah. they don't have a lot of air. Yeah, uh, that is enough. And, and they pinged the lab, so I think they know about the T3. Oh, they saw, they saw. They saw the T3 check, yeah. No, yes, they did. They have a single gremlin. Uh, you oh, see that gremlin? Oh, yeah, yeah, I see it. I see it. <laughs> they spotted the lab, they know what's there. Now the bobbers, the problem is, they can either target the winds or they can target the AGOs. But they, if they kill the AGO, they lose all their bombers. They die, yeah, 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 yeah. they die for it. So, that, because the uh, geos are so spread out, and they're away from the bases, it's not really worth it, I don't think. And, oh, yeah. they lost the fighter cover, and the, mm, 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 the bombers are getting Not a lot out. of bombers, yeah, not a lot of bombers left here. It's, it's, going oh, to it's be, looking kind of weak. Oh, OP layout, yeah. OP layout. Oh, if you got this. It's not enough, it's, if, oh, it's not enough. If, oh, you that's this, so unfortunate. if you got yeah, this, if you got the second yeah. converter, <laughs> I would have uh, typed OP layout in all chat. I would have done it. Randy would have done it. Now it's looking rough for reclaiming how, the. the how, how are they dealing with the Marauders? The Marauders aren't. Uh, they're massing still. They're massing. They they know that the Marauders. They want to go in the water though. That's yeah. for sure. They see. They did though being sneaky. He. Oh, they spotted. Gotta... I mean, they already spotted, but... Yeah, he has spotted. They know it's coming that way. They know it's coming that He's way. He's making submarines in his naval lab. Oh, wow, that's... Interesting choice. Really? Yeah. I don't think it's gonna be enough. Like, five Marauders are just gonna walk past them. He's making Razorbacks now. So he's, he's making the Marauders for the raid, and then the Razorbacks to fight the... The units and the choke points will be actually very strong. You can't you can't really go around them. You have to face the the Razorbacks head on, and you'll die. He's massing the Marauders yeah. on the side. Six of them. He's going I don't in. Like, they have a radar, so they must know about this yeah, lab. No, they did see. They did see it coming. But, and I really don't like that they they spotted the lab. Didn't as well. do anything about it. Uh, why is it going with the Marauders? He got scared, he saw the submarines, I guess. Oh, yeah, but just but run Just go on them. land, yeah, <laughs> just go on land. Maybe he spotted the oh. commander. No. Nah, surely not. It's a bit late. Oh, he's gonna the, go that way. No, the naval lab. Because they, they got huge stuns on the other flank here. Yeah, they, they meet, the bulls got EP. I yeah, gave... They're gonna get the starlight here. And they're gonna rely, chill, but they're Ooh. losing the sea completely here to the. The subs. They they did lose all the submarines to the converters exploding. That's funny. He lost oh, all three of them. <laughs> but yeah, the the Razorback is gonna be the nail in the coffin. I yeah. Think, actually. They can make starlights. They are making starlights. There you go. They have multiple starlights. In fact, they have a lot of defenses in this area, and they do have a cloak commander. In fact, they have two commanders in the choke point. So the oh. Razorbacks uh, can't just run in by themselves, and they can't just sit there and skirmish because the starlights will shoot at them constantly. But look look at the goddamn scaling on Randy, it's getting scary. Yeah. He's he's building boy. He's building, but the echoes are not that different. Like red team no. is slightly ahead. <laughs> and ducks? Ducks from uh, Daywalker. Yeah, they're gonna see that there's nothing there. They should just walk over with the yeah. goddamn marauders. Yeah, if they went with the marauders, they could have killed AT. There's there's not yeah, much there. Yeah, yeah. now there is. But now there is, yeah, because he spotted the marauders. <laughs> 80, and now they're just cleaning out the sea. They're getting all the, they get they control both seas. Which means yeah. not only do they have all the mexes on the seas, but they I'm also have all the vision. Middle. That's actually five head. Oh, yeah, That's, that is five head. They should they should have uh, attacked with the ducks at the same time. I think. <laughs> yeah. Oh, but there are there's a pop up. Or, there are two yeah, pop ups. Oh my god. I don't know why they're and so the afraid of one. Slow, slow, cloak your commander. Oh, that was not the enough damage. Is, uh, is destroying Damn. Ducks are going in. The ducks are just gonna be able to kill all T1 ships. There's no, there's no counter for the uh, for the ducks. I think. 
Yeah, the, I think that's good. They need the control of the sea. Yeah, the, the death charges from the oppressor, from the destroyer, it's just not enough. They, the ducks have too much HP. They'll kill everything. AT is moving his commander. Destroyers are actually good against ducks if you get enough of them. Yeah, but for the like cost... Pound for pound for metal, I do think the ship is better than ducks. Duck is 330 metal and he has 2.4k HP. Oh, he reclaimed this lap. He's not going. He knows. He knows he's going to struggle to fight this. Yeah, yeah, he's giving up. But they still did the damage, right? Uh, Randy? Oh, shit. Sword? Randy's cooking. All right. <laughs> oh, my Rambunctious God. Rambunctious Randy. Randy. Uh, look at the Marauders. Oh, that's They're still that is super marked. annoying. They're still super annoying. Like, can they walk up there? No way. No, no, no. They can't. The terrain is too rough. But they, get, they can't go up here. And there's no defenses and no commanders. Uh, Zekrus is making Aphus. He's making pop-ups now. I don't know if he can make it fast now. He's probably going to get one or two up. In time. I mean, if he gets one or two, it should be enough. Yeah, They're low be. already. <clears throat> yeah. Eh. He's making Aphus though. So if it doesn't work, he's screwed. Definitely. And if he loses the Aphus blueprint on all the BP. And we go, ah, never mind. There's... No, no way. No way. <laughs> Look at all the units. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, they're it's okay. <laughs> Those marauders could have been utilized so much better. It is a shame that he backed away. Yeah, I feel like they were too afraid to pull the trigger on them. Wait, what happened to all the ducks? I'm telling what? you, they're not that amazing. Three of them left? How did they all... Did they suicide into the... Oh, it yep. looks like they suicided Lock into the yep. torpedo launchers. Oh, God. And the marauder, how many left? One alive? Two, Two. of them? They lost one on the shore, which means they can just res or reclaim that. The eco diff is favoring red team right now. 21% metal income and... Uh, yeah, for oh, how it's... long though? Mm, the thing is, they're yeah. not scaling and when that Aphis gets up, it's gonna swing, I think. Definitely, definitely. Is, is Flash gonna scale here? No, Flash is making units. I suppose he can hold this lane with the uh, spy bots and uh, snipers and welders. Yeah. <laughs> Gun slingers? <laughs> Yeah, Did he I don't accidentally know why he built him. four gunslingers? <laughs> I think he built them in the beginning and forgot. Ah. Uh. <laughs> <laughs> is it Thor done? Did he finish it? Uh, did I he think cancel he cancelled it and, and an make him vanguards instead. Yeah, I'm building an Aphus instead on the side. Oh yeah. With almost no BP though. It's gonna yeah, take a long time for it to finish. Six minutes. Jesus. The vanguard's not a bad idea though. I can kill all the snipers, right? Because this is what they're struggling from. They can't, they can't really approach because they have wilders and gunslingers, and they can't really stay afar because they have snipers. It's a very strong yeah. combination. You yeah, could. They're building anti-intrusion. Finally, maybe they'll find the gremlin. Yeah. Is it they... still alive, the gremlin? No, no, no. I died during the bombing run. He got smacked. Oh, I'm almost sad. It was so sneaky. <laughs> I think, I mean, this could be countered with spy bots as well. Uh, Flash does not have a lot of... Uh, oh, they do have the Thor, it's on the left side. Right, they It's do. actually pushing really hard. Oh, we missed it. Oh, never mind. Unimpeable and does have a lot of HP. I don't think the Starlights are going to be able to kill it fast enough. But no, the commander is the number one threat. The two yeah, yeah, commanders, no, <laughs> each on yeah, one corner, waiting. just waiting. Oh, they're waiting for the D-Gun, baby. Uh oh know. he's skirmishing, he's skirmishing, but... It's, he He's just still dealing a lot damage. of damage. He's yeah. still dealing a lot of damage. And with this EP launcher, he can he can hit stuff. He can hit the lab even if he charges up. Just sitting, oh, still doing decent damage. Yeah. But he can yeah. just go back and repair it as long as he doesn't accidentally lose it too. Yeah. Oh, the oh! De the de they spotted the yeah. commander. Uh, sending a horde of grunts against the Thor. I don't know I'd... why they're doing this. Yeah, yeah. this is uh, weird. Thor is anti-spam. <laughs> I don't know if that's a good idea. Daywalker yeah. swapping. Oh, <laughs> look at Daywalker. <laughs> he swapped to naval on the other on the, in the other lake. <laughs> yeah, I was like, okay, we lost this side. Let's do oh wait, they're going T2C on the left. Oh. T2C on the left side. That's Buccaneers. gonna have an impact for sure. Yeah. He's going missile ships. Oh, I wonder, missile that's ships placed. They can destroy everything. They can Down destroy here. literally yeah. everything if they stand there. Like. Imagine if they stand here, they can just shoot like this whole area basically. Yep. They'll have to be careful because they walk at this T-Gun over the edge. Potentially. Yeah, but the oh! thing is, I think it can reach a T3. Eight dimensions. Look at uh -oh. him. Uh-oh. Uh-oh, they know. Did they see it? 
They, there's no. They know it's no there's radar. No, oh now they no see. Radar. Now they see the dots. But is Randy yeah, paying but, attention? Do they react? Do they no. react? I don't think so. Not in time. Degunning the T3 lab would be way worth it, even if he loses his commander. Oh, the... oh for sure. He's gonna and get the a four. Th four two. Oh, double whammy. Oh no. He's Hello, got... sir. Randy, you noticed? He's gonna go oh. for the fusion as well. <gasps> Not much you can do about that. Randy one. is running away. Why? He doesn't want to trade. It... He I wants to come been... alive, which makes sense. But you can reach res it. It's in your own base. Oh, that's true. He just, yeah, now he he's just losing a lot more lost than his fusion. Should have. He's gonna lose a geo. <laughs> and he lost Ooh. a marauder and all those wins and mixes. He's still going. Oh my god. <laughs> AT, it's a you horror. beast. Oh, it's the ticks are gonna horror. stop him. The ticks. It's a horror. And he got all the BP. Oh my god. Oh, he still has two towers alive. Two towers. It's out. Oh, two counters, yeah. Yeah, yeah so he can kind of rebuild his BP, but yeah, that, but that was, was very rough. painful. If Randy traded with him here, he would have been able to stop him from killing the fusion and the Geo and the BP. Yeah, he should have actually traded. You're right. He should have insta traded when he started. I mean, that. look at the eco diff. And yeah, blue team it's... is so far ahead. Zekrus has two Aphers. And for yeah, some reason, it's... he's choosing to make Marauders. <laughs> And that is not the right unit's choice. I actually, uh, no, I think it's actually the right one. They already snuck once through the bottom. But so uh, I think actually they could I be mean, sneaking with the... Uh, again. There's not going to be any sneaking doing on this side. But look uh, at the towers. It's like T1 garbage. Uh, Ten Marauders? They're running through. Ten Easy. Marauders? You think? He has two Aphids. Ten Marauders is not expensive. He's going to the going middle. He's going mid. Though. Yeah, he's going yeah. mid. He's not going that way. It uh, might be actually a better idea to go mid, because uh, now they're porking up this side. This side is completely on. Oh, unplugged. wait. I want to see the ships. They're bombing. Yep. Oh, yeah. They're getting the... The Geo is... Uh, they they're got the fusion. Destroyed. They, the lost C is going to lose them the game. Yeah. Plus, because he can only do that because he didn't have the C. That's how he snuck yeah. in. Like, and they needed they, to fight to get the C back, I think. They do not have air superiority it. either, so they can't really shirk in this. Even if they tried, they have an ar arrow storm. So... That's so rough now. He's making dragons, Shamon. He's making that bomb. Dragons is gonna be the unit of choice. Uh, also, I'm I still, not sure I like that. I still don't know why LDM is is uh, casting the same case we are casting. <laughs> I don't know. I think this is we're far into the round. I don't think there's a lot of games going. Maybe. Got Marauders coming mid. Eh, double command. He went in with three. Okay. Yeah. I don't hate it. It's only ticks. ticks to deal with them. <laughs> ticks. Not OP counted to Marauders. It's funny. And they're not doing a lot of damage. She did get the ant here though, which could be valuable. Yeah, he got yeah, one. Here. But look look at the missile ships on the other side, like Yeah, they're closing in. What's the what's the range here? Can you can you hit the Randy's AGO? Oh, that's not the right Yeah button. yeah yeah. You can for sure. Maybe you have to be closer to the shore, though. Yeah, you have to kill the shore defenses with the buccaneers, I you think. You can, but you can. That marauder not a big deal. killed an extra mix. Here comes the bombers. It's Armada bombers, Kek W, never mind. Might as well be ticks, sky ticks. They're not accomplishing anything. Yeah, they're trying to bomb again, but this time they're getting shot down completely. Yeah. But AD, the AD, issue I mean, is... 80 is shuriken while 62 shuries over here. He's, he's chilling. There's no, there's no raids gonna happen against him. Door coming through from blue. And uh, Zekrus is fighting uh, high gain at sea at the same time, as well as Flash going uh, hover tanks. Right? He's not gonna be able to retake the sea. It's, it's impossible for him. Yeah, it's they... looking like the GG here. Yeah, that is GG. You know what? Uh, the big mistake for me was the left sea. They, they let, they lost it and never. They could have fought it to get it back completely, but instead, I don't know. That was a mistake. Oh, the AGO. Oh, oh, it's a one big more, pop. One more slap. One more slap and it's over. Yeah. Bye bye. I uh, is he reclaiming it or repairing it? He's repairing. That's a repair. Unfortunately, no, now he's reclaiming he, it. No, he's reclaiming. I think it's. He knows. Oh, oh he's, he's healing. Repairing. He's healing again. <laughs> he's playing the mini game. Oh, he's oh, reclaiming. He's reclaim. gonna reclaim. Reclaim? Yeah. Before the bombs oh. land? Can he do it? Perfect. Oh, Perfect. Okay. He did it. I did it. 
I mean, that would have popped all his converters and uh, all his BP. Oh. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. He's like, he's like, he's gonna bomb it for how long <laughs> before he knows? <laughs> like, how he's can like, you do this no quickly? Boom. How there's is he no healing boom. so quick? <laughs> <laughs> oh, look at Randy making Aphis here. Finally made some BP. I mean, they, they got a chance, but I think AT's maneuver was what won them the game. Like, yeah, 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 yeah their but, win. But it is all because they lost the control of the sea. Like, yeah. the fact that they can even bomb two bases right now, like, look, they're even using the sea to bomb with air. Like, yeah, how the fuck are they gonna deal with it? It's too, it's too much map control. It is Armada bombers, though. Kick W. There's a lot of anti-air. Holy shit! Look at the line of uh, anti-air bots. The Manticores. That is yeah, 10k metal. Though. 10k metal of, in anti-air bots. Of shit. Let me tell you how bad Manticore. No. Okay, we see the dragon's gonna get shown, and they're gonna try to take the sea back. That's the play here. I don't Dark like God. this at oh, all. They do have air storms, but one, two, three. Three is not enough, I don't think. I don't Maybe think they so are. No, no, no. Nah. Dragons are actually... Oh! oh they they're need dying. to focus the AA though. Yeah, they're dying. Dark on yeah. Oh no, that's... Uh, it's 5k metal down the drain. Oh no. Yeah. He's coming they in one by one. need to focus the one. air, but... The issue is dragons' AI are retarded. Yeah. I think what you have to do, instead of using attack command, you have to do select target. That way, yeah, no yeah, matter yeah. where they're flying, they'll still target the, the, the unit. He lost yeah. one dragon, and now the fight is coming in. No, they're calling GG. Yeah, it, lo it looks over. Look two, how two. much is coming in here. Yeah, GG, they honest, out. I did not expect, I did not expect him to lose this hard. I would think that this map would be better for the more OP co-op. It's all about that left C. Yeah. You can't have both C for the end. It's just... Yeah. It's the same problem yeah. on the spring straight. <laughs> you yeah, lose both yeah, Cs. Yeah. Your giga it screwed. Is... It's too much. Like... You lose so goddamn much control. Like, what the hell are you gonna do?